Rhonda Wills, listen, I get it. I went to law school. When you're a lawyer, you tend to be very analytical. You don't think with your heart. If the guy doesn't have a certain level of success, this is gonna be too much for him. You read it like you're reading a case. I think you're delusional of what's out there. The main thing with Rhonda is getting her to open up her heart and not be so focused on the resume. What does he do for a living? How much does he make? No matter how much money you have, if you have no one to share it with, right. it sucks. We gave her an awesome guy, a guy with an MBA, very close with his family, wrote children's books, and it still wasn't enough. Did you have fun? I didn't think it was very romantic. You're quantifying his money, you're quantifying everything about him. I flew out here and decided to put my life on blast at the chance but maybe meeting a needle, needle in a haystack. Patty didn't deliver that. Bottom line is, if I don't think she's hot, there's no way. When you pick a partner to spend the rest of your life with, that should be the pickiest decision you will ever make. You are a gym rat. I am. You look like one. I know. Let's see what you're looking at. Did you just ask her to see her ass? What bothers me is that Patty uses this as a way to validate her absurd suggestions that I should be dating women of 40 years old. You're so focused on so much superficial that you need to realize who cares as long as you're happy.